So then I said, buy me another hot dog and I ain't paying for no baby. That is classic. Did you really say that? Yeah, I did. Man, some of the stuff you come up with, man. I just don't, I don't know how you do it. Guys, the funniest thing just happened to me. Yo, what, what happened? Guys, you might want to sit down because this story is a banger. I'm, I'm sitting down now. Oh, yeah. So what happened? Oh, yeah, so it all started in 1986. Jackson, what happened today? Oh, I've got to tell the background so you're all up to speed. Jackson, we don't have time for the background. Just tell us what happened to you today. But I need to give you an overview of the iran Iraq conflict. Jackson, just tell us the story about today. What happened to you today? Okay, so if you want the super short version, I was walking down the street in Penelope. Actually, I used to go to university and study physics with Penelope. Actually, this one time, me and Penelope were Jasper, going... tell the damn story! Wait, let me find this video of Penelope. It's really funny. It's actually so good. Jackson, I don't give a fuck about Penelope. Alright, Penelope, you can head home. Wait, she's here? I was gonna bring her out to explain the story, but now you've gone and upset her. Alright, I didn't mean to upset Penelope, but you didn't need to bring her. This is so elaborate. Just tell us the story. She was gonna perform the musical number. How am I supposed to do that on my own? Alright, Jackson, this is how it's gonna go. No music, no special appearances, no singing. Just tell us in one paragraph how the story goes. Alright, so I was going to get an ice cream, and you know when it's like 4 o'clock and you're kind of hungry and you start to get the tummy rumbles? Mm-hmm. Well, it wasn't at that point yet, because I actually just had lunch, so I was pretty full still. Anyway, so Marcus was there, and Marcus said... <laughs> oh, Marcus. Anyway, so Marcus was there. Oh, wait, no, he wasn't there. He was there yesterday. Marcus wasn't even there today. Why would you even bring up Marcus? I thought he was there. Even if he was there, there's no need to mention him, because clearly he wasn't a part of the story. Look, I'm telling the story. Lachlan, do you hear a story being told? No, Darcy, I do not hear a story being told. I have not heard a single coherent part of a story today. Do you want to hear the story or not? Well, at this point, I don't even expect to hear it, alright? So, uh, I'm a bit disinterested, if I'm honest. No, Jackson, tell it. I want to hear it. Just tell us a damn story. Okay, this is only going to make sense if you've seen every movie in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Well, I, I don't think I've seen the second Ant-Man movie. Well, this isn't going to make any sense. Go catch up, and I'll tell the rest of the story. What on earth could cause your story to make no sense to the listener if they missed one out of 23 movies in the Marvel Cinematic Universe? You're just going to have to trust me! Just tell us the story! It can't be that hard! It can't be! Okay, so I was walking, and I tripped over. Yeah? And then what? What happened next? That's it. That's my story. God with a beam, God with a beam. Don't fall in love, cause it's not what it seems. Remember you said that I'm stuck in a dream. You made me bitter, you're making me mean.